Hello class, um, I just wanted to make show you a quick video on how to make a video using ClipChamp. Um, so when you come to ClipChamp, all I went to is ClipChamp.com, C-L-I-P-C-H-A-M-P.com. I'm just going to go to login, or if you haven't been here, make sure you go sign up for free. If you go sign up for free, there will be an option to click a Google button, I'd recommend that. I'm going to click that, and it's going to do its little thing. It's going to dance around a little bit, get comfortable with itself, and it's going to just uh, load here. So there it goes, and then I've got like a million accounts, so I'm just going to click here. That one, it should recognize it. And then there we go. So now it says we have, so on the free version of this, you can make um, five webcam recordings per month and so um, that's what we're going to do it just says right down here record via webcam so I'm going to click here and there I am hello hello and um, all I need to do is just hit the start recording button when I do that click so you can do the little countdown and then I'm on a movie, woo! Okay, then when I'm done, I just go finish recording. And you'll notice on the blue little thing down here, it's gonna be loading. Now, while, while it's loading, um, let me just take this time. You guys are going to be putting both of your ex explanations on the same video, because I don't want it like a million videos, and so that's why you're doing this as partners, even though really you're doing it individually. Um, but you're gonna have two pictures on the same whiteboard, and you're going to have one movie, and on that one movie, you're going to have two explanations. Um, and so, I believe on ClipChamp, they have to be five minutes long, so you should have about two to two and a half minutes to expl explain that. I think that should be good enough. Again, I'm going to grade this on the quality of your explanation, the quality of your, of your written explanation, the quality of your verbal explanation, and the quality of your particle diagram to explain this. Okay? So as we're waiting here, you can see this blue little uh, thing is almost done. Um, and it will take a little bit longer if you have a longer video. And so, um, therefore, you might have to wait a little bit. Now, I'm not the only reason I'm making this video is because I'm not 100% sure. If, the web, if your camera app on your Chromebook that's built into it works, Man, I recommend using that. It's going to be a lot easier. Okay, so then once I have all this, um, what I want to do is I want to click... Um, what I would recommend is I would go share video, and I can go share it on YouTube. And so when I click YouTube, I can say video from ClipChamp. And I can add a description. This is a nonsensical video. And then I can say it is private. However, um, in order for me to be able to see it, uh, I'm, I've had some issues with this. And so what I would make, what I would recommend is making it visible, just publicly visible, because then you don't have any issues. And then when you're done with it, you can just delete it. So then I can go publish. Another option would be to go just share it on your Google Drive, and that would be to where you don't have to publish it on YouTube. Um, and so you could add a title in that. So you can go YouTube or Google Drive, add it there, and then you can just upload it on there. So when you upload it, I'm looking for two things. One, your written description, and then two, between the, your partner and you, you should have one video that's posted on there as well, okay? That is all, folks.